is Paul. Yes. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm at the hospital and I was I'm just kind of sitting here looking at the Coast Guard base over there. And You ever looked around and not really looked at what you thought you were looking at? <laughs> you let your subconscious mind do the thinking for you and you don't know what you're thinking. <laughs> you know, I spent some time thinking about my conscious mind, my subconscious mind, my ego, my id. <laughs> And it seemed to me that the conscious mind really decides what you do think and what you don't as much as you would think that my conscious mind does. <laughs> and I went outside and I walked back in. I thought, you know, I must be wrong. <laughs> it, it must be that I'm wrong. Yeah. See, I sent some emails to the Port Angeles Police Department and I didn't get any phone calls. I must be wrong. I don't understand how the human mind works and you're a cop and you know how it works because everything you do is because of your life experience and your education and your training in law enforcement <laughs> and you can remember every fucking thing you've ever learned. Oh. Now haven't you decided that it's your conscious mind, not your subconscious that makes the decisions about what you do? I thought it was my subconscious mind that had thought about everything my conscious mind had thought about, but I was wrong. It's um, it's one of these situations where you are right and I'm wrong. I didn't get a phone call. Now, I'm kind of thinking that when you've been reading, yeah, that's what they call it. Either the shit, the piss or the cum, yeah that really you've been using your conscious mind and your subconscious mind did accept what you were reading as being, well, your own thoughts or the thoughts of somebody else. <laughs> you know, if you were to take apart the actual human brain, ouch, I'm thinking what you're reading when you was in your conscious mind, yeah, your subconscious really rejected it. Ouch. Now, each of us is given a brain you know, with the understanding that we all think a little different. Yeah. You think as a police officer that you don't have to enforce the law because your conscious mind um, has been reading for the last decade the top secret Oprah and Fish movies. Yes. And as long as you continue with, with what you've been doing, mm -hmm, your subconscious mind will never be allowed to think about what you've been reading. Oh. <laughs> now... Let's say we did an, an evaluation of a hundred brains. Mm -hmm. We took a hundred different individuals, right? Male and female, 50 human beings. Yeah. Then we took 50 of your dogs that were made to look like the 50 male and female and be like 25 male, 25 female, both human beings. Yes. Then 25 female dogs and 25 male dogs. Yeah. Now, uh, the thought was that your dog, yes. Mm -hmm. Hmm. Things just like you do. Po, po, po. But I think the subconscious mind of the dog is not as developed, yes, as the human mind. Mm -hmm. Now you're reading the shit. Pooch. Your dog has your anus. <clears throat> and your conscious mind says, well, this is very humorous. Mm -hmm. I find it interesting. Yeah. But your, your subconscious mind says, no, I'm sorry. Those thoughts are not processable in the subconscious of an actual person. They're absolutely worthless as they pertain to the intelligence of human beings. <laughs> now, I was, I was sitting here looking at this uh, Judge Ken Williams. Yeah, why don't you get me your dog? Uh -huh. Then every time you fuck through your dog and all the time that you, you came and your dog was reading your orgasms. Now, it could be that people have a much uh, much better developed subconscious mind than the dogs do. Yes. Now, when my wife petitioned for the dissolution of marriage, um, why did you serve me at the same time as arresting me? Because it says here, sheriff's return of service. All right. Mm-hmm. On 531 of 2012, yes, 
then on June 4th of 2012. Could somebody call the Clallam County Sheriff's Department? In fact, Sheriff Bill Benedict, yes. Could I speak to your dog, Coach? It seems that your dog doesn't have a subconscious mind. <laughs> as radical as that thought is, yes. As much as you want to say I'm crazy, Coach, you've got to be the stupidest fucking sheriff. Now, having your dog on you means that your human mind will not process the conscious thoughts of your dog into the subconscious mind of the human mind. Let's look at it, okay? Your brain, Sheriff Bill Benedict, and the brain of your dog. <laughs> your dog decides to piss. Mm -hmm. You read the thoughts of your dog in your conscious mind, and your subconscious mind... Mm -hmm. We'll not accept it as human thought. <laughs> now, this concept of Sheriff's Return of Service on May 31st of 2012 is... Did you have a return of service for both the dissolution of marriage and uh, the arrest of... Well, let's see, it would be... You served me and you arrested me at the same moment. Yeah. Um... Did you serve somebody other than the respondent? Because it, it should have been, oh, that was when uh, Heidi petitioned the court. No, I don't think it was. Because she petitioned the court on May 31st and there was no attempt of service. <laughs> exactly how do you have two returns of service there? Yes. Now, see, right here, law enforcement worksheet, right. May 31st, petition for renewal order. Uh-huh. Protection, notice of hearing, protection order, so on and so forth. Yes. Motion hearing, Brent based and poop. Okay, there, on May 31st. Yes. You arrested me on May 29th, Memorial Day weekend. Yes. Mm -hmm. You have a sheriff's return of service for the dissolution of marriage that you served me. Yeah. But what's the second sheriff's return of service? Because no one can be served except for the respondent. The petitioner should have had a copy of the motion to petition for dissolution of marriage. Yes. So why don't you look at exactly what are the two sheriff's return of service? Mm -hmm. Now, there's this response, yes, to the actual uh, petition. Well, it says other here. Mm -hmm. Maybe you could get me the others on every public court record where it's an other. Yeah. Other children in the middle, attendance, children in the middle. There's two of them. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Now, uh, I did respond within the 90 days, but I'm kind of thinking I was wrong. If I hadn't responded, yes. Could my wife have gotten a, an order uh, for default dissolution of marriage? Yes. And uh, I went ahead and responded when you served me and arrested me at the same time. Mm -hmm. But when you did not serve me after uh, she had motion for a default dissolution of marriage, yes, um, I couldn't really respond. Yeah, isn't it obligate? I just I just wanted to know because I think I'm wrong. Mm -hmm. I think my human man. Subconscious mind is smarter than your fucking dog, Sheriff. Do you understand how stupid you are? Now, the dogs don't have a subconscious mind. And if they do have it, it's not any bigger than a P. P-E-A. <laughs> so you decide to let uh, a large number of what looks like law enforcement mm -hmm, that doesn't think like human beings, yes, make all the decisions for the police and sheriff's department because Deputy Fish doesn't have a subconscious mind. Well, I'm thinking my subconscious mind thought I was wrong. Mm -hmm. See, if I don't respond then she could have gotten a default dissolution of marriage. And then when she motioned the court for a default dissolution of marriage, you didn't give it to her because I responded to the actual uh, petition uh, for dissolution of marriage? Yes. Now, you can kind of, well, imagine, yeah. What if you'd give me... <clears throat> well, you didn't. You didn't give me any additional notices after that, did you? Mm -hmm. You found out that I do respond to notices of court hearings? Yes. But being the total anal, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. now listen, asshole. There's nobody in here, okay? 
was I wrong? Mm -hmm. Thinking that if you don't serve me, I don't respond. But if you do serve me, I do respond. And for every time that you had a court hearing without me being served, uh -huh, I didn't respond. Now, I know you think I'm wrong. <coughs> I want my fucking sons. Do you understand, you piece of shit? I think your dog doesn't have a subconscious mind.